Oh, Let's there he is. Oh. Just you and I Looks like he's right on time. I gotta put my pads on so I don't scratch up my arms. All right. It's the bill of lading, folks. Very important. Department of Transportation says that uh, you gotta fill this out. It's an inspection form. And uh, I have to tell them to come on up here, I guess. Car looks pretty clean from here, anyway. Yeah. Let me get this back door opened up for him. Come on up here. A lot of folks that have done this for the first time, they're very nervous. Don't be surprised. Probably doesn't know exactly where I want him. Keep on coming, buddy. That'll be good right there. You can turn it off and step out if you like. How's it going today? My name's Kevin. All right, glad to meet you. Hey, bud, it's a nice looking car. It's a nice looking car. Listen, we're gonna do an inspection. I basically say the same thing to everybody. The vehicle's white. I'm gonna walk around it. If I see anything that isn't white, I'm gonna reach over and I'm gonna to touch it. We're not allowed to clean nothing for fear we might hurt something. But I'll touch it. If it doesn't move, I'm gonna mark it on the bill of lading and I'm gonna take a picture. So let's start with it. It looks like this might be a clean inspection. Oh, you must have left your key inside and that's okay. Let me start with the rims. If I'm not writing something, sir, then that means it's okay. But if I find some, I'm going to point it out first. Always got to look down here. A little scrape up under here. You don't have to get down there if you don't want to, but it's up to you. Where you've went in the driveway, you rubbed up. I'm going to have to put that on there and then get a picture of it here in a second. All right, sir, what I need you to fill out, it says print, date, and sign, okay? Let's take your time. Let me, let me hold that for you. Yeah, that wins something else. Go ahead and print it. Yeah, go ahead and print there. You always got to put one of these out in case anybody comes around. Now listen, I'm going to load it up. I don't need any help. You can just stand out of the way. Do you have any questions of any kind? No. Okay, did the office tell you? Huh? How long is it going to take? Oh, okay. Uh, it's generally three to five days. That's what the office says. But most importantly, one day out, 24 hours. Like this time tomorrow, if I thought I was going to be there, I'm going to call you. We're going to work it out with your schedule. If you're at work, you tell me, hey, I don't get home till 5. And we work it out. Okay? So wait for my phone call. I'll let you know. That's perfect, you left the keys in it. That's where I'm always gonna want them anyway. Now folks, we gotta tie it down. Lots of ways to tie vehicles down. This is just one vehicle. It's gonna have its own way, but from an old classic to a hot rod to a Ferrari, totally different. And we just have to go through each and every one of them. This one's very simple. We're gonna use over the wheel straps, four of them, one every wheel. Each strap, like I told you before, rated at 5,000 pounds. Less than a 5,000 pound car, so we're gonna put 20,000 pounds of securement devices to guarantee this precious cargo is never gonna move. All right, all right folks, now we're gonna tighten it down. We're gonna get, like I said, four straps, two on the front, two on the back. Once again, over the tire straps. These go into this steel right here, it's called E-Track. They clip in. Thank you. 
Oh, sometimes not so easy. Sometimes I like to refer to ourselves as high-tech towing companies. They tow it across town, we tow it around the world. Now for all my guys, I teach them this, you can go too tight. But too tight is really, really too much, and it's hard to get that tight. But just get it nice and tight, because if you get it too tight, this is gonna pop out. Strap's worthless. All right, well, we're almost all done. Last but not least, have to check everything. So I've tightened everything I went around that I don't wanna waste your time with that. Now listen, is that a job well done, or is it? Not as far as we're concerned. Our competition's trying to beat us every day. And in good business, there's always room for improvement. Okay, now no matter who you use, doesn't matter. All of these points are very, very valid and you have to go through them each and every time you ship a vehicle. Here at Incognito Express, we're striving to haul your precious cargo in a very professional way. Thank you very much. See you soon.